Welcome, everybody. Andy Goodwin coming to you today with some super, super exciting news. It's groundbreaking for Cyril. It's one of the biggest announcements that uh, we've ever made, and we are so excited today. Jono and I have longed for what we think is the missing jigsaw puzzle or the missing piece to Cyril, and that is to have our own medical advisory board with certified doctors helping our IBOs globally with guidance from proven medical professionals. And today, I'm very, very excited, both Jono and I are really, to announce the head of this new medical advisory board. We looked long and hard for exactly the right person. And I'm about to share with you his credentials, which are incredible. He achieved his Bachelor of Science, magna cum laude, honours in anatomical sciences at McGill University, Montreal, Canada. He has a Master's of Science, Medical Biophysics and Immunology at the Ontario Cancer Institute from the University of Toronto in Canada. Immunology really, really important to both Jono and I and, of course, Dr. Gita Jensen. He's also had a surgical internship, medical doctor with the Western Ontario University. He's had a surgical internship at St. Michael's Hospital in Toronto, Canada, surgical residency, general surgery, and cardiovascular surgery at the University of Toronto. He's done surgical residency with ear, nose, and throat at the University of Toronto, and has a fellowship in facial plastic reconstructive surgery from the University of California from San Francisco. He has a private practice in ear, nose, and throat, facial plastic reconstructive surgery in Santa Rosa, San Francisco, which he currently runs today. He has had board certifications from the American Board of Facial Plastic and Reconstructive Surgery, the American Board of Otolaryngology in the Head and Neck Surgery, and he is a fellow of the Royal Canadian College of Surgeons. He's been the Chief of Surgery at the Suta Medical Centre in Santa Rosa, Total Quality Management Control in the Suta Medical Centre of Santa Rosa, and he's a member of the Cancer Research Committee at the Santa Rosa Memorial Hospital. But the list doesn't stop there. Some of the other amazing thing this doctor has done is he is also part of the European Society of Facial Plastic Surgeons. He's with the California Academy of Cosmetic Surgeons. He's with McGill University Alumni Society and the University of Toronto Alumni Society. He has also written his own articles, medical articles that have been published in peer-reviewed journals. And on top of that, he's been a much sought-after speaker at a multitude of medical conferences around the world to speak on his findings. So he is completely qualified, maybe even overqualified, to fulfill our role that we have as head of our medical advisory board. And it is my great pleasure to introduce to you the one and the only, Dr. Stanley Jacobs. Stan, welcome to the call. Thanks, Andy. That's really uh, a lovely introduction. It's uh, fairly accurate. I know you embellished it a bit, so thank you for that. <laughs> um, well, it's it's really an honor to, to be with all of you today, and it's very exciting. As I've been thinking about uh, Cyril and you and Jono for six months in deliberation, figuring out, is this going to be the right match for me? Um, and, and yes, it was. And, and I'm also, I mean, it's, it's greatly responsible. You're responsible, Jono, for me being here because of what you've accomplished. I know you've been with the company for a while, but you've taken it to a whole different level, which is very exciting. I mean, you've got established products, but you're taking it to somewhere even greater. And that is very exciting to me. So thank you very much. Well, I mean it when I say we are super excited to have you on the team. A lot of our discussions around what we can achieve together, the difference we can make to the lives of our IBOs and their customers, we really are 
setting the benchmark for others to follow us. And you said, yes, you were right. You took a, a long time to consider us, and we're grateful that you did, and we're grateful that you accepted our offer. What is it particularly about Cyril that you like the most? Is is the depth of the science? I mean, to, I'm a scientist, obviously at heart, as you as you as you know. And as a what you really have to be as a doctor is you have to be at a scientist at heart, and then a practicing physician because that's what really makes a clinician. It's that doctor patient relationship, of course, but also the science behind it. And I reviewed 41 scientific published articles that you gave me and that I researched and cross-referenced those, it wasn't just the ones you gave me, into multiple other articles and books that took me several weeks about your products and about algae in general, not just animal models, a lot of, almost half were human studies, which is really impressive, and some really good data that Dr. Jensen has put together along the way, including stem cell activity, anti-inflammatory activity, um, and all of these things working together at the cellular level. And that's really what convinced me to sort of over the top to say, you know what, this is something that I want to be part of. Well, again, that's testament to your professionalism, your attention to detail, but more importantly, your willingness and desire to understand the depth of our product and for someone to research 41 medical, 41 studies is, is quite remarkable. I guess people looking at us today will say, you know, you're, you're, you're a doctor. And traditionally in our field, medical professionals sort of poo-poo the products that we have or you discount it. How do you answer those in your profession that, that feel that way? Well, the real answer to that is they didn't do their research. They didn't do their homework, A. And B, you need to open your mind as to understand what else is going on. Again, I've been doing this for 37 years. I read medical papers all the time. I research things in my field and other fields and Journal of American Medical Association, not just plastic surgery. It's a general field. And I, what, what we're missing, obviously, are many things. We need to understand that there's a lot more than just traditional medicine. And, and as I researched more and more and found all these studies and studied the data, and which was very compelling with your products and algae products in general, it opened my eyes. And I think it's important also when you're a clinician to, to be studious all the time. You need to always learn. And part of, honestly, my working with you is to learn more about not just your products and the science behind it, which will gain momentum, but also your IBOs, your customers, and what are they saying? How can I fit this together? And that's an exciting part for me because that opens up a whole different world. Obviously, I'm going to put it through the prism of scrutiny and scientific study, but it's opened my mind already, even just in the last few months studying this, this data. So I would say to people who are, who are traditional medical doctors that you really need to cross-pollinate, I call it your ideas. I mean, think, think outside the box. How does the world really work together? We don't know everything. I mean, that's the first thing about becoming, I think, a greater person in general is to admit you don't know everything and to say, what don't we know? How can we be better people? How can we learn? How can we listen to people more? What are they saying? And then how can we take the science that's already there and your work and the work behind your products, which are amazing, and get, get that understanding out there in basic language that I'm going to sort of spell out for the IBOs? I must admit, my skin tingles when I think, and you and I have discussed uh, for many hours, the opportunities that exist for our IBOs with your involvement. Um, I'm excited about some of the projects and the initiatives that we have planned. What do you think our IBOs can look forward to from your involvement with us? Well, Andy, the, the exciting thing is going to be how we interact, how, we're go how I'm going to work with them in plain English and get them to understand what's going on in the science behind your amazing products. And that's really one of my fortes has always been in medicine is to take complex ideas and give it in plain English so my patients can understand the same thing I'm going to do with the IBOs and their clients. So that interchange of ideas is going to be great. The other thing that I really want to focus on, which a lot of other products don't, but yours do, is the concept of cellular health. 
because you could talk about proteins and carbohydrates and fats and so on. And then you talk about, some people talk about the organs like liver and heart. I get that. But really what's missing in between is the cell activity, the cell health. And our cells, after all, are the people in the community of our body. We need the people or the cells to be healthy. So, and Cerule does that. Cerule works on cell health. And that's something I really am excited about to share with your IBOs. Well, Stan, you're talking our language and, and you're teasing them now because they're all sitting around high-fiving each other, getting excited. I can tell you that Dr. Stan will be coming to you on Facebook. He'll also be doing two webinars a month. And we've already sent out for questions the top most frequently asked questions from both IBOs and customers. And in his first webinar, he'll be addressing those questions in beautiful, plain English. We, we love it. So we're super excited about that. Plus, we've got other initiatives planned with Dr. Stan that each and every one of you are really, really going to enjoy. So Stan, again, from both Jono and myself, as I said, we feel that you are the final piece in our jigsaw, the missing link, if you like. Um, we're so excited. We're so grateful that you've decided to join the team, and we can't wait to get started. Thanks again for joining me today. Everybody, watch Facebook. Watch your e-blasts. More news about Dr. Stan coming out real soon. Thanks, Andy. I'm really looking forward to working together. It's going to be a great, exciting trip. Thank you very much.